we got some Pokemon cereal. YouTube, welcome to the channel. My name's Jason. Here on this channel, I do a lot of food and product reviews. So if you're new here, please hit that subscribe button. As you can see, I'm a little excited today. We have some Pokemon cereal we're gonna be trying out here. Let's get into this. All right, so Pokemon Berry Bolt, naturally flavored with other natural flavors. So it's naturally flavored with other natural flavors. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Um, sweetened corn puffs with marshmallows. Looks like the marshmallows are Pikachu and his little thunderbolt shaped. And then we have like, looks like red and purple berries in there. Um, the evolution of confusion, starting with the first column, follow the evolution of each Pokemon in order. Oh, you're supposed to figure out which one, you know, you got here, here, here. This guy to there to there. I, I I could be wrong on those. Ignore that I did that. I I'm I'm not a super huge person into Pokemon. I I play Pokemon Go. I don't know all the characters. I don't know all their names and everything. But I'm excited about this cereal. Let's see if it's any good. I got some trainer questions over here. <clears throat> As you know, we do a lot of cereal reviews on here. Majority of them aren't very good. They all pretty much taste kind of the same, sorta. Kind of smells like tricks. Either I got a bad pour or there's just not near as many marshmallows as there is in the box, as you can see. I can see a handful of them there. Let's try a couple of these berries. Those are pretty much like tricks. But, maybe not, wait a minute. Now, these are really, Almost like a blueberry flavor for the the purple ones. Hmm. Let's try it with milk. I don't know how I feel about these. It's, it's a really strong berry flavor. I mean, really strong berry flavor. So I'll give it credit there. I mean, but it's almost too much. Like it's like a, a, a blueberry and maybe, am I getting, I'm trying to think if I'm getting a little raspberry possibly, a mix of blueberry and raspberry. The marshmallows are a non-factor. You know, at least from my bowl, I don't have a whole lot and they don't really add any flavor to it. You don't even, let me get some more marshmallows in here. The, 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 the taste of the berries is so strong that it overwhelms the marshmallows. I will give it credit. It is, it's, <clears throat> I'd say about all of the all the cereals I've done so far on this channel, this is the berriest. Berriest, yeah. It has the strongest berry flavor. With that being said, for me personally, I don't know if that's a good thing. You know, it's almost too berry tasting. Where I don't know if I like this combination of these two types of berries. Like when I first tried it and I smelled it, I was like, oh, I got tricks. And as I ate a few more, I was like, no, that's, that's a deeper, richer, if you will, berry taste than say, um, 
Trix. Trix is almost more fruity. This is, like I said, almost a blueberry mixed with a little raspberry. I, th I think it's the flavors that are coming across in there. And I don't know if I'm really like it or not. It's hard to say. It's kind of off-putting to me. And maybe it's just because you look at it and you think it's going to taste like any other cereal out there. You know, just artificial, sweet. And it's not really tasting like that. It's, it's like I said, it's got a really strong berry taste up here. Into berries. And I do like berries. I just don't know if I really like this. I guess I'd have to give it some more time. I'll try it a few more times. Not on the video, you know. And try to figure out, you know, I'm just, I don't know. I'm confused by this one. This cereal has me confused because I don't know if I like it or I hate it. Or not hate it. If I like it or just like, hmm. I don't know. I, I can't give you an honest opinion of where I'm going to rank this because let's see. It's been sitting here. Let's see if it holds up its crunch. Mm. Slight. It's not as soggy as some cereals. And that's the thing is it's like a really crunchy cereal. I just don't know where to put this one. Like I, for flavor wise, for what it is, it's good, but I don't know if I like that in a cereal. I guess maybe I want it a little sweeter and sugarier or something. I don't know. I'm going to give it a four just because I don't know, four or five. I'm just so confused by the cereal. Let me know in the comments below. Have you tried this? What do you think of it? Were you like, whoa, that's an odd, not an odd taste, but that's a really strong berry flavor for it. At least in my opinion, it is. Let me know what you think of it. If you've tried it, if you like this one or not. Would I give it a four or five? That's just my taste preference. I guess for what it is. I mean, it's Berry Bolt. It's, it is what it says it is. So I guess as far as what they're advertising and what it tastes like, I'd almost have to give it an eight because it is a really strong berry taste. You're not going to eat this and be like, oh, this berry bolt. I don't even taste any berries in this. You will. So I guess as far as what they're advertising, it's eight. My personal preference. I don't really care for it that much. I'll give it a four on my scale of cereals I like. Take it for what it is. It's between a four and an eight. You let me know what you think it is. Like I said at the beginning of the video, if you're new here, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell notification so you're notified every time I upload a new video. And I'll see you guys next time. All right, so for the bonus clip, I'm gonna try to pronounce some of these and you're probably, let me know in the comments, you know, call me out. I, I'm not a big Pokemon player. I don't know these, so what do we got? Sobble, then I think Sobble probably goes to, what's he turn into? No, he goes there. No, Charm Squirtle goes to Wordle. Oh man, which one is which? I guess he goes here. So I'm gonna say Sobble goes to Sobble to. What is that? Is that are those Z's or what? What? Is... Drizzle? Are those Z's or G's? Is it Drizzle? So I guess. Uh, Sabo goes to Drizzle, and then to, uh, Intertellion, and then obviously Squirtle, Wordle, Blast, Toys, Blast, Tortoise, Tortoise, Pimple Up, Primple Up, and what are these now? MP, I'm not, I'm done. MP, I don't even know how to pronounce half these names. <laughs> I'll see you guys next time.